there is so much information out there these days that it's very hard to know what's good and what's bad and it's so fucking confusing. So today we're gonna, gonna crush four myths that will hopefully help clear some of the bullshit that you might be hearing or seeing or reading or whatever. So number one, fruit makes you fat. Absolutely not. You show me one person who's gotten fat from eating too much fruit and I'll show you a liar. So when it comes to fruit, just make good choices, low sugar choices like berries. But 100% of the time, people who are worried about eating too much fruit are also like going on two or three day binges at the weekend. They're not over there. I don't know why I looked. Um, they're sneaking junk food when no one's looking. Um, fruit is not going to cause you to get fat unless you're eating like a truck full a day. Just make good low sugar choices. Myth number two, eat clean, but eat as much as you want. Again, this sounds good in theory, but the number one factor in whether you lose weight or drop body fat is how much food you eat. That's it. If you eat too much food, you'll gain weight. If you eat just enough food, you'll stay the same weight. If you eat less food than you need, you'll lose weight or drop body fat. The biggest factor in whether you maintain those results is food quality. So um, if you eat less food than you need to drop weight or body fat, but they're shitty foods, you'll rebound. Um, and likewise, if you eat clean, but eat as much as you want and eat too much food, you'll gain weight. So how much food you eat matters, whether it's good food or bad food. Number three, tea is gonna help you burn loads of fat. So you'll see these like skinny teas or even green teas and herbal teas are great for aiding in fat loss and they have some antioxidants and benefits, but the majority of your results are gonna come from your nutrition and your training. And I mean like 95%. And the other 5% is like supplements and teas and stuff like that. But you need to focus less on the 5% and more on the 95% that you're not doing correct because that's where the majority of your results is going to come from. Number four, alcohol is fattening. I hate to label anything fattening because if you have too much food, you'll get fat. Um, if, you, if you have too much alcohol, of course you'll get fat. But I wouldn't label it as fattening. You don't have to give up alcohol completely to get results. But if you go out on a night out and go to a nightclub till three o'clock in the morning and do shots and cocktails, and then the next day you're having hangover food all day, you're not gonna get results that way. But if you make smart drink choices like clear spirits or um, don't go on benders every single weekend, then you can still have alcohol. You just gotta be smart about how you do it. Four mitts, quickly crushed. I hope that helps you guys navigate through some of the bullshit that's out there.